Hello guys, hello everyone. Welcome to my channel. My name is Joseph Benson and in today's video I want to show you uh, the actual key starter for the Benson B1 Ultra Helicopter. I was able to acquire this and I tried to do the video and show you how actually uh, the whole key starter and some of the strobe light control uh, look like. And of course, um, this is how it comes from where I bought it and this is kind of the Benson B1 key starter because uh, the Benson B1 actually it's gonna have a key starter but it's gonna be a push button start this is actually a push button start and of course I'm doing this video to give you the walk around on how um, the whole thing look like if this is your first time here make sure you subscribe to my channel and click on that notification icon so that each time I have a brand new video like this about the Benson B1 of course you will be notified and guys let's take a closer look on how um, the engine start actually look like for uh, the Benson B1 now this is how I, I bought this um, panel and I think about $25 or so from Aliexpress and of course this is how a, the back look like and I'll show you exactly how to mount it later in the future when I'm fixing this into the Benson B1 Ultralight Helicopter Dashboard, I will show you how actually the whole thing look like. And of course, it comes with some of the parts. It comes with those uh, few parts. And of course, you can see um, some of those stuffs are relay. Those All of these is a kind of a relay. You can see this is 12 volt, 30 a And of course, is a relay, okay? Sorry guys, I'm using one hand to record this video and one hand holding uh, I'm, I'm using one hand to like go around the whole thing and also using one hand to hold um, the camera So I'm just trying my best to make sure that I give you the best Again, um, this is what you need to do This is kind of rocket switch um, You pull this up like this Sorry once again, you pull this up and you push this for the ultra light helicopter ignition okay you can see it also have it also have a light on the tip of the rocket switch this is now ignition then you can bring this down like this but not to push it down completely once that is how it's once that happened and to start the helicopter you just push the button okay you just have to like push the button in and of course the helicopter will start automatically there's one thing i actually want to let you guys know about how this actually work um anything that has to do with ultra light helicopter um the benson b1 we're trying to do our best to bring um the best out of it actually and we're trying to do as much as possible to bring out the best technology out of it uh, the benson b1 actually is going to be a push start helicopter it's not a key starter helicopter because um we're not using key, it's a kind of keyless, it's a push push button to start and of course the helicopter will start running and when I'm going to install this into the Benson B1 Ultra Light Helicopter Dashboard of course I'm going to let you guys know how actually um, the whole thing is and you take advantage of it and of course the those ones here are kind of rocket switch for like strobe light I can use this one for strobe light maybe this one for landing light and maybe this one for any other thing in the ultralight helicopter and of course i'm having other what other stuff inside like um i'm having some other stuff inside like about the some some of the rocket switch and of course i'm decided to like do the whole thing um for you guys first before uploading the video and again i will show you how i did all this connection how we con connect the whole thing to the key starter um this push button start the key starter and of course um if you want to off off this i know it's a kind of question you guys will probably want to ask by the time you on the ignition of course you on the ignition like this and you push button to start and once you want to off the engine you just have to press this down completely of course you can see that um, the engine will off and of course you um continue um the engine will be on an idle stage it's off completely so if you want to on it again remember to like push this uh, uh, rocket cover up and push this on like this 
and just bring this back down a little bit and push the button start like this and the engine will start and let the engine start um it start running and of course you can see it from the other end and if you want to off it to take a look you can press this down to off it like this then the engine is totally or completely off so this is one thing about uh, how the key, uh, key uh, starter control for the Benson B1 helicopter actually look I think I bought this around um, $26 or so and of course I bought this from Aliexpress and it's very very unique so you can also also buy something similar to this and use it to on your ultralight helicopter and of course you bring the best out of it it's gonna be like a new modern stuff talk of the town um, the helicopter is it's gonna be one of a time uh, one of a kind because I think it's gonna be if you have this it's going to be the first ultralight helicopter with a push button start and of course it's unique and of course everybody will gonna like it so I decided to do this short video and show you guys what I've done so far, how far I've gone about the Benson B1 Ultra helicopter, um, getting the key starter, uh, key control panel that will start the engine, how I got everything ready. And of course, I'm having a lot of items about the Benson B1. And anytime soon, I will be installing the whole thing step by step, and everything will look good once again. So, guys, this is why I, what I decided to show you guys today. And this is how today's video is gonna end. So you can tell me what you feel about this key starter, particularly in the comment section below. And of course, if you have anything in mind regarding the Benson B1, like a kind of contribution, you're very much free to let me know in the comment section. And of course, I will be appreciated to for your on your contribution, guys. Thank you so much. Make sure you like the video because if you like this video, you're telling YouTube that this video is way way too important. And YouTube have to YouTube will go ahead now. And show this video to as many people as possible. So, guys, this brings us to the end of the video. I want to thank you once again for taking your time to watch this video to the end. Um, hopefully, I will see you in the next video on the Benson B1. Until then, I want to say bye bye for now. Take care.